So a third of the students at one local high school have a parent serving the military. Yeah, and for some of those students, making it to college can really be a challenge. NBC7's military reporter Bridget Naso is here with more on why that is, and also, Bridget, what the Pentagon is doing to help out those kids. That's right. We're talking about Sarah High School in Tierra Santa, and this is what the military families, the kids there, have to deal with when it comes to their education. Students in the military and their families, they move more frequently, having to switch schools, which can result in getting behind in classes or not being able to get into certain classes at all, like this advanced placement class for juniors at Sarah. Many have parents who deploy for months at a time, and they have to be very self-motivated when it comes to their homework. Well, today, San Diego Unified School District officials, Congressman Scott Peters, and the commanding officers at Naval Base San Diego and MCS Miramar announced a seven hundred and sixteen thousand dollar grant that will help boost grades by providing more funding for AP classes and materials for students at the school. It's a partnership between the Department of Defense Education and Activity and also the National Math and Science Initiative. So it will really motivate people to actually try in school and try to go to college. It makes a difference for our military kids, it makes a difference for our military families and at the end of the day that means readiness for our Marine Corps, readiness for our Navy. So. The three-year grant will also be used to support other students at Sarah High School because the school has such a high percentage of students from the military that the DOD wants to be sure the entire community is benefiting. By the way, April is the month of the military child, so this announcement is pretty fitting. Bridget Naso, NBC7. Bridget, thank you.